All right, all right. Why the game start again? Because it uh, it loops. It loops so you can maximize your score. Oh, all right, here we go. Super C. Now, I haven't played this game in a while. So hopefully I can actually remember how this game works. But they start out the same way where they, uh, they drop you in and they immediately give you a machine gun. And I think an R is the second thing you get in, in the original as well. Oop. You think it's way harder? Uh, parts of it. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's harder. It's hard for me to say just because I, I I've played so much Contra now that uh, I'm just so familiar with it that this will seem way harder just because it's not the game I'm so familiar with. Let's not die right here. I've been known to die there a lot. Heading over tomorrow after work for Mario 2? Nice! Did you take Friday off? Or you just... You're just really gonna beat it. Uh-oh, uh-oh! Okay, it's all right. I had to bop that guy, but it worked. I'm not gonna get the quick kill, though. All right, ooh, did it. Yeah, I got a drink. But I didn't get my water. Mm. Friday off, sweet. Uh oh. I got caught up on the level there. Yeah, the first stage in this game is really chaotic. That's for damn sure. And then, in true Contra fashion, for the second stage, they give you something completely different from a different perspective. Oh boy. Which, I really like that, just the idea that they, they mix it up in all of them. Like, Contra 3 has the, uh, also the top-down levels, but, like, Mode 7's them. Uh, which I like. I think those levels are fun. Some people don't like them. Oh, jeez. Here's the thing about a lot of bosses in this game, though, is that... Um, at least if you have spread shot. The bosses are sometimes just a little easy. That guy just doesn't shoot you if you stay there, and then if you have spread shot, you can just hit him. Here's, here's the thing though, I think this level is when this game gets legitimately very difficult. Okay, okay. Alright, alright. 
kicking ass. Woo! Digging these graphics. Yeah, th it's, this game definitely looks a lot better than the first one, and I, I think the first one looks great. But yeah, this game looks awesome. Probably some of the best graphics on NES. I love the, how the, the bullet sprites look. Like, they're like, they're, they, I mean, they look like bubbles, kind of. But hey, it's an 8-bit game, and the bullets look awesome. Uh, you know, it's how the bullets look, and I think they look great. Oh, this level has that stupid part that I hate in it. I think it's this level. Okay, this boss I've never completely understood. Damn it. There we go. Man, if only I hadn't gotten shot that one time. All right, this part I used to have memorized, but I forgot it by now. So now I just gotta like bait each thing into moving and check it. Guess and check. Definitely want that spread though. Okay, I think it's like almost done now. There we go, jeez. Here's another boss, it's like, oh wait, oh shit. Oh, you have to jump. Oh my gosh, I thought this was another boss where you didn't have to move at all, but I, you have to jump over that bullet. Well, don't I just look like a big dummy now? A big dummy without spread shot. Yeah. Oh, I was gonna headbang for a second. I've never played Fester's Quest, I've never even really seen it, unless, I may have seen like an AVGN thing of it. Oh, I sure would like to have spread shot here. Machine gun is nice though, that, that'll work. Who is my favorite rapper? I don't know. I mean, I can tell you without any hesitation whatsoever that the rapper that I've listened to the most is Jay for the Dark Lord. And I think he probably is, but I, I've listened to so little of anything though. And also, the thing about Schaefer, I think a lot of his beats are kind of bad, or like a lot of his hooks are bad, you know? Like the song, uh, The Way You Talk, I, is that how it's called? The, or that's, is that what it's called? The Way You Talk? I just sounded like English was my second language there. Is that how you call that song? Anyway, um, like that song, I think the hook in it is like super not good. Uh oh. Yeah, like parts like this are pretty tough. Oh, come on, wasn't that a spread shot that I just missed? By the way, your favorite uh, red and blue bubbles are back for this part. That was definitely a spread shot that I just missed. Okay. Just 
gotta get the right angles on these. Do I remember? Oh, Batman Return of the Joker? Um, yes. I remember it a little bit. I remember if you, uh, sometimes the cartridge wouldn't load properly, and when you went to the password screen, which had the Joker's face on it, damn it! See, I just missed two more power-ups because I died at exactly the wrong fucking time. And I'm all, I'm positive that that one was spread shot. So now I'm gonna die on this upcoming, I, I'm, I'm so dead now. Oh, I just screwed up big time. But anyway, um, I remember if the cartridge didn't load right, sometimes the Joker would spawn with like some of his hair on his nose and I thought it looked like boogers and I thought it was the funniest shit I'd ever seen. This part is so hard without spread shot. Oh, come on. Um, yeah. Yeah, this level is very difficult. Uh, I think this is probably the hardest level in this game. This part is so hard without spread shot. That could be a quote for any time that you're playing Contra. Any time that you don't have spread shot and you're playing Contra, that's a that's a reasonable quote. There are, I mean, there are parts that are really easy with like laser though. Right, I, I yeah, I get it though. That's why it's fun. Oh, jeez. Yeah, yeah, this level is really fucking hard. I, I... Okay, no, it's machine gun right here that I was thinking was spread. That second part is spread, though. When they come up the second time, and if you die at the wrong time and you don't get the spread because of it, you're effed. Like, the second top-down level is really hard, too. Okay, yes. I agree, this game is way harder than the first one. I agree. There's our spread shot, though. This is going to make things much more tolerable. There we go. Carve a path. Oh, 
Uh oh. When is it gonna fire? Okay, jeez. There we go. Mr. Gimmick. I've never seen it, but I've heard it's good. The game starts to go really crazy here, like super unique and off the walls as far as like, just like, way more different from the first one than I expected. With all these angles and stuff. It's like Mario 3, they got slopes now. That rock used to kill me every time, the one that falls straight down. Because you jump over and you get hit by it. You gotta jump first, wait for it to fall down, and then jump over. More uh, Mario One more than uh, Mario World. Oh, that's right. Th okay, this boss is like impossible. Unless you have spread shot. Oh, there's so much shit. I'm not even damaging the boss right now, because I'm just, like, doing so much freaking damage control. Yeah, oh, there we go. Jeez, 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 jeez. Take a drink. Think, think, take a drink. Ding, 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 first Mr. Show reference. Actually, I already said, Gary, we can already see his bing bong earlier. I, I did say that part. All right, I said that earlier. And then this level is just kind of fucked. Like, these stupid mouths, they just hit you. They just come up under your feet and hit you. These things, I'm not even really sure what they're supposed to be doing. I don't remember how to even do that part. Okay. How many more stages? Uh, eight? Eight total? This is six, I think there's eight stages? There might be nine, I don't remember. Okay, here we go. Oh, see, they just come up under your feet. I guess these things make it so that you get hit by the bugs because you can't shoot them? I, I don't know. I don't really understand what that enemy is supposed to be achieving. Okay. Also, these enemies look stupid. Like, suddenly the game's graphics look shit. I think. I think this stage looks terrible.
Pulling a rolling thunder, what does that mean? Oh, that there's so much shit on the screen? Right. This part, I just don't even know what they're going for here. You just stand right here and you shoot in the middle. I don't know. That boss is incredibly easy. All right, so that's that stage is really hard. Um, if I remember right, the game starts to get really crazy here. Oh, jeez. That was just a bad time. What am I doing? I should have used my invulnerability to get past that guy. Okay, that's fine. Let's just... Let's try this again. Oh, that's... That was all my continues, I guess. Oh, boy. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I haven't played Super C in a long time. Face palm? How is that a face palm? I died in Super C, it's a hard video game. Alright, so I'm thinking about... Possibly switch into some, either some Magic the Gathering, maybe go back to Mario or play Mario 2 or something. Uh... Oh, I wasn't sure if that bullet was going to hit me. I was doing so well, apparently not. I ran out of lives. I ran out of continues. Yes, just, uh, oh, did I miss the spread shot? What? So, hmm. maybe I could just <laughs> jam this until I actually beat it. <coughs> this game's making me warm. It's so intense. Yeah, for games upcoming on the stream today, we've got Magic the Gathering, possibly more Mario, possibly more Megami Tensei. I'm just not sure yet. I wouldn't 
recall having a lot of stuff on the screen pulling or rolling fun. Plenty of games have plenty of stuff on the screen. I don't want to give that game the honor. Oh, geez, that one scares me. That bullet. Would I think Rolling Thunder was programmed to torture people? I don't think any game is. I, I, in fact, I'm really just like sick of the whole masochism gaming kind of joke. Like about how the creators of Dark Souls hate people. <laughs> Dude. I'm just, uh, like, I'm just sick of that whole joke. You can't walk into that while it's exploding. I'm much more relaxed this time than I was last time, and apparently that's not a good thing. I'm just, I was waiting for someone to, to chime in when I said, should we play Magic or Mario? I wasn't planning on playing more Contra, so I was just, Cruising. <clears throat> cruising as in like Wind Waker cruising, you know, not not like uh, going fast. Which isn't it funny that to say that cruising can mean that you're going fast or it can mean that you're going slow. Like you're on a cruise, you're on a leisure cruise, a, a treasure cruise. You're on a cruise, you know, it's going slow and steady. But then you can also be cruising USA. That might have been spread. I don't remember. No, it's F. Hey, that life force can't touch walls? Yeah, that shit's annoying. Let me touch walls. I guess it makes sense, though. If you're piloting a ship, you probably shouldn't run into shit. Touch walls in Gradius? Oh, okay. I haven't played Gradius in forever. And I didn't play a lot of it when I played it. I sure as hell never, like, beat it or got reasonably far in it, I'm sure. Okay, here we go. Oh, we're gonna get the quick kill. Boom, got the quick kill. I mean, that's what I call the quick kill. The, the real quick kill is probably even faster. I guess what I should say, as far as, like, this game's quality compared to the first Contra, is I think that this one has way better graphics, um, and overall I think that the levels are just as good. I, I, I like that they're harder. In fact, that I could very much see me, like, thinking that this game is better in the end because of the, uh, I, I like that it's more difficult, but... 
the bosses are lacking, I think. I think the bosses in the first one were way better. Even though the first one has a really easy last boss. And this game has a really good last boss. Well, this game has a pretty okay last boss. Um, still. There's bosses like this in this game. And the next one. Where's my boy that I play with a lot? My brother? He's in the chat. Flex Retro is here in spirit. How are you, Who Rose? How are you doing? Man, I can't believe I forgot my water. Well, I can believe it. Okay, okay. If I look at games like Super C and wonder what the hell happened to Konami, I think everybody does, yeah. Just what happened, Konami? Look how fucking rad this game is. Uh-oh. Yeah, Contra 3 is awesome. I've only beaten Contra 3 once, though, because the last boss sucks. Like, I seriously just hate fighting the last boss in that game. I think it's terrible. Uh, but the entire rest of that game, though, is just fantastic, so... Maybe I should not complain about it anymore. Okay, shoot again, and we'll jump on top, and walk right, now walk right again, okay, oh jeez. This thing I just, I, I don't quite understand you. Okay. Terrible isn't too hard, or just lacking. Lacking, the mechanics are stupid and not fun, I think. Do you know what I'm talking about? Is Would it be spoilery for me to explain what I'm talking about? The shitty, shitty last boss of Contra 3. Okay, there we go. So in Contra 3, you fight a boss that's kind of similar towards, uh, to... Okay. Uh, you fight a boss that's kind of similar to the boss that was on that top-down stage that was really easy that I fought a minute ago. Uh, and it's great. But then there's a second phase where it's like a brain. Hey there, Take. There's a second phase where it's just like a brain and a bunch of different, like, spheres of different sprites appear around it and start spinning. And when you shoot one of them, it selects a phase and it goes into that phase for a minute and you have to shoot at it. Um, and hurt it while it's in that phase. And then after a few seconds, it starts over. It does that again. The, the icons come back around it and start spinning and you shoot at it to select a phase again. And, like, a lot, of, it would be, I think it would be a cool boss if it was just constantly f cycling between phases. But to have it be like the player selects it and it has to stop and do the whole thing and most of the phases are shitty, it's just stupid. And it just has so much goddamn health that it just takes forever. So yeah. 
and if you select the correct phase over, you can just select the same phase over and over again because there's one that just shoots out like bombs and power-ups at you. And if you go to a one side of the screen, it can't hurt you. So it's it's just it's just a big hunk of garbage. Well, now we're on this part with spread, so that's good. This part that I game over it on last time. Now we're here without having died yet, and we have spread shot. But Tycoon, how are you? What you been up to? And weren't we talking about doing something together at some point recently, Take? I thought we were like, were, were we like just talking about doing like a specific thing together? It might have even been your idea, the, the, the thing that we were going to do, and maybe that's why I don't remember what it is. Backup spread. I call her bone itches. Ah. Oh, that was close. Does Super C not go for a lot of money? I thought the price on it was kind of decent, wasn't it? But the, yeah, I, I don't know. The first Contra is not a rare game whatsoever, but I think it's just such a good game and such a popular one that people will pay for it. Okay, yeah, I, I totally don't remember what I paid for, for this here Super C. Boy, howdy! Alright, now that I'm a little warmed up to Super C, I appear to be doing much better. I have spread right now, I don't want to accidentally pick up a different power-up. Whoa! Do we get boulders yet? So right here, if you try to jump over this thing, boom, that boulder falls down and hits you. So you gotta jump first. That's like, that's one trap that I, I totally remember. Yeah, I hear you. Like, there is definitely a certain amount for a game that I wouldn't pay. And you know, I totally understand if your amount is different than mine. Like, I'm not, I'm definitely not against people buying repros, because it's like, you know, you just have a different amount that you want to pay. 
Yeah! Like, for me, I haven't bought a new retro game in a while. Last one I bought was Doom 64. Um, so, and, and I'm just fine about, uh, I'm just fine with that. Just, like, not buying games very often and just playing, playing games a lot. I like to master my games, you know? I like to be a super player. Okay, let's hope these mouths don't screw me here. Okay. Good old spread shot, doing its thing, being awesome. Come on! Go back, get the spread then. My thumb is so sweaty right now, I like, can just hardly... I can't control the D-pad right now because my thumb is too sweaty. Good fucking god. Well, I was deathless until then. Seriously. These top-down levels, like, really just kill me. I'm still fine. I just wish I had spread shot still. But yeah, I mean, my thumb was just slipping off the D pad. There we go. And that's what I'm talking about, like, that boss looks difficult, but you just stand in one spot and shoot it, so... Yeah, I don't know, man. Okay, here we go. Now I gotta, like, pay a bunch of attention. Okay. I I miss that power up every goddamn time. Oh man. So now what? You have to go down one of these sides. If you want to get a power up and I miss both of them. Oh my gosh. I hate this part, honestly. Digging through this stupid shit. And like you have to get those stupid power ups. But they're hard to get because you can't move around in this shit. But alright. Oh! Another R! The last, like, the last two power ups I've gotten, I've managed to get, have been R's. Oh my god, what the hell, dude. Uh, I'm kinda getting contra here. Which is where dying spawns you in an extremely shitty position, where you'll just die a bunch again. OK. 
Okay. I really don't know how to deal with the, these enemies. I've had a lot of trouble with this in the past for this exact fucking reason. Just like... Okay. Less bitching, more beating Contra. I... I don't know what to do here, though. I'm going to jump down there and die. Okay, 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 okay. Less bitching, more playing well. First game over. So I gotta just get the power-ups is my problem. Right here there's two power-ups. There's what I didn't get last time, I didn't get this machine gun. That kind of started my problems. Nah, the game over is fine. Well, I had to continue. good tin muffin moment there. Alright, I'm not gonna get this laser. And this time I'm gonna try going down the left side. Oh! Okay, what did I just get? Was that an R? An R is on the left side? Muffin is a bot. Tin muffin is a bot. But because you said chocolate chip, it said something that it knows about the words chocolate chip. Okay, there's spread. Okay, spread just went away because it took me too long to deal with that. And that's gonna fuck up the whole rest of this section for me, but that's fine. dead even though it's still on screen and it's like that because I killed it while it was on off screen. Shit. Well, might as well just go. Except that I just lost my... I lost my, uh machine gun because of that, which sucks. Ugh. That boss is pretty good. Oh, I forgot about this level. Right, so...
God damn it. All right, that's fine. As long as I have another continue, but I don't think I do. Oh, I do. Okay, great. Okay. So... Well, I just missed the machine gun. I... cannot remember how to deal with this fucking level right now. Just shoot the... shoot the enemies. Okay, getting a little frustrated at myself. Okay. Okay. This level, uh, it's got some fuckery, you'll see. Completely my fault. I, well, I couldn't do it. Oh my gosh, that was extremely frustrating. Well, I got up to the last stage and then just could not handle it. I don't know. Maybe my hand is tired. Whoa. Um, that's all the Super C I can handle. Because I... There's... A couple things in this game that, I, that make me like the first one more. And one of those things is that... I think that level three is really boring, and I never want to play it. It, it makes me like not want to play the whole game, but okay. That's all I got there. I need to play some Magic the Gathering. I need to just calm down and just uh, play something that's not so intensive with the hands, because I, I just played a whole bunch of Mario, and then Contra, and I tried Super C twice. Um, but yeah, so I guess I need to play this game again so that I can actually get good at it again, because, um... When I die, yeah. I want to go straight to hell! Luxeal, hey, thanks, thanks for the follow. Um, but yeah, I, uh... Whew, that was That was tough. And, uh, I don't remember that last level being so hard, but I think the main problem, uh, was just... I, I couldn't get those power-ups in the beginning. It was driving me nuts. Okay, so let's uh, let's move on over to here.